Um, so we got off the bus right over here. Um, I hopped down here, turned around to look and make sure that Jackie was still behind me. That was the bus stop that we got off on. Um, he basically, we got to right over here, I turned around and he pounded me in the face and just started shoving me and we ended up over here. I was sort of crumpled up against the glass and he was hitting me. And he's screaming at her. He's like, shut up! Yeah, shut he's up! yelling at me to shut up and calling us sluts and cunts and just using really gross slurs. So I told him to get off of her and did a really sad attempt at pushing him, like he was big, and then he punched me a couple times in the back of the head, and then a, from there, like she said, everything gets kind of hazy. Like this other guy came and tried to grab him. He ran, he bolted down Commercial Drive. Uh, we didn't really see where he went. Uh, a couple of people chased him, and they ended up getting uh, a picture of him running from behind. Six foot three, really tall, really heavy set, belly. like, like well over 200 pounds. Um, white guy. He just looked like a normal, like clean shaven, blue collar guy coming home from work. Yeah. Big white guy with brown hair. The only way I can make sense of it is just like pure hatred. Like we didn't do anything. We didn't talk to him. We made no kind of contact with anybody on that bus ride except for each other. That was. It's got to be the only thing that he just did not like to see two girls kissing and just wanted to put us in our places. The east side over here, like I've never had any kind of like really negative comments about my sexuality. And now I really, I don't know, I don't, wouldn't come here by myself. I, obviously there's hateful people everywhere, but I mean, just that kind of overt display of violence is just so, like it totally changed the way I look at everything. So like, there was no amount of being safe that would have stopped it short of like pretending we were friends or whatever. But, um, yeah. Probably could have been straighter, but... But that's kind of not who we are, so... Probably not gonna happen, so... I, I just want to get back to normal and learn to come back to this neighborhood without having a panic attack. That would be cool. I just really want that guy to get caught, and I don't want anybody else to get hurt.